Good morning, my name is Aaron Thomas and I'm from the Manchester Central Campus and it's a pleasure to be with you whether you're watching it in the morning, the afternoon or the evening and I pray that the words that I share as well as the scripture will be an encouragement to you. There's also so many other great people that share daily in the devotions um, through the life of our church and campuses so please do check in um, every day there's great people that are sharing different scriptures and different thoughts that will no doubt bless you. The scripture that I'm going to share this morning is from Isaiah 41 verse 10 and it says, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. I want to just sit with that for a minute isaiah 41 verse 10 fear not is the opening part fear not in our humanity we all have times where we're fearful of the situation and circumstance um, and the, maybe the consequence or maybe the result or the unknown but we're instructed here in isaiah to fear not the greatest currency that we have as christians is faith that's the greatest currency that's the greatest currency that we have it's not our friends it's not our family it's not um who we know the greatest currency that we have in the kingdom of god is faith is faith and it's impossible to please god without faith so as you're walking through the season that you're currently in whether you're in the mountaintop or in a valley, I want you to understand that in Isaiah it says, and this truth still rings true today, fear not for I am with you. Take confidence that whatever you're going through right now, in your situation and circumstances, the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings is with you in it. Is with you. That gives a different level of confidence when you know that he's with you. And I want you to magnify the Lord with me this morning. That's a great song, by the way. So if you, if you don't know what that song is, go on YouTube and put in Magnify the Lord with me. It's a great worship song. But I want you to hone in on worship, prayer, and the, the resonate and, and really mull over. Isaiah 41 verse 10 where it says, Fear not, for I am with you. Take hold of that truth today, that he is with you. It also goes on to say, be not dismayed, for I am your God. He's not somebody else's God. He's not just Aaron's God. He's not just the pastor's God. He's your God, personal to you, interested in your, your details and the details of your life and your situation and circumstance. God not only loves you, but is interested in you. It also goes on to say, I will strengthen you. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. At this moment, I want you just to pause it for a minute. Pause the, the devotion for a minute and write down maybe three things that are concerning you. That you may be a bit anxious of or fearful of or that concern you. It could be related to yourself. It could be related to a family member. It could be a loved one. It could be a work colleague, whatever it is, but it concerns you and it's causing you to be a little bit fearful or a little bit concerned. Okay. I want you intentionally throughout today to magnify the Lord to a point where in your heart and in your mind, Whatever you wrote down or whatever you put on your phone as the three areas of concern are going to be positioned in your heart and mind from a different vantage point. That You're going to be looking down upon the situation and circumstance rather than looking up from it. Almost as if it's a stepping stone to where you're going next. That might sound cliche or might sound, oh, that sounds good in theory. But I really want you to take hold of the truth of what has been spoken 
in Isaiah 41 verse 10. Fear not, for he is with you. Do not be dismayed by the situation and circumstance that you're in, because the Lord is your God, personal to you. He will strengthen you throughout today. He will help you, but invite him into the detail and the conversations of your life. My prayer, as I share a final thought, is sometimes, and myself included, I've had a few business challenges over the last few months. And sometimes the situation looks bigger than my God. And I've had to realign my mind, my heart, through prayer, through worship, through reading the truth of what has been spoken also in Isaiah 41 verse 10, to amplify and edify the Lord in my heart and mind, not what somebody else has said, but in my own heart, in my own deepest thoughts, to know that the situation, whatever the result, is not going to be bigger to me than my, my edification and, and also um, perspective that God is bigger than the circumstance. So as you walk through today, know that whatever you wrote down is real to you and is a concern. However, like it says in Isaiah 41 verse 10, fear not, for he is with you. God bless you. And I look forward to seeing you at a campus nearby soon. Bye.